Yeah. All right, what's going on, everybody? This is iPod King Carter here with a head gameplay designer for NBA Live 16, Connor Dugan. Uh oh, it's about to go down. What's up, guys? So, what we're looking at here um, is all the gameplay improvements that we're showing at E3. There's a lot more that we're going to be showing later. But first thing we're talking about is dribbling. And what we've done with dribbling, just basic left stick movement, uh, we've made it a lot more responsive and a lot more fluid. We deal with a lot of the transition, so everything looks smooth. I can beat a guy off the dribble with just the left stick now, or left stick and turbo, um, and it feels a lot better. So what's really cool about it, when you play in five on five, when you're mm -hmm. using the new screen and roll mechanics, you can really like get it like, you know, attack the hip and get around the corner, so, so it feels really good. Now on your right stick, we have some brand new size up animations, or something similar to the size up animation last year. Last year you just held a button, now you go back and forth, and it looks like a fluid one seamless animation, and there's a bunch of signature stuff. So right now we're looking at LeBron, and it looks like LeBron. And then on top of that, we got a new move where if you just hold the trigger and cross or hezzy, you can just do like an aggressive attack move. Okay, and that right there, guys, is RT or R2. Yeah. So that's what he meant by trigger. Yeah. So you can do behind the back moves. I can do hezzy and go, or I can go cross and go. And that thing really works. It looks seamless. And it really works well, again, attacking uh, off the screen and roll. So if you get really good. I'm, I'm currently looking at a replay mode inside a shoot around. Oh my God. So it's seamless, right? So that's cool. So we've done a lot with dribbling just to make it feel that much better this year. Now, I want to show you shooting. Now, shooting's cool because it's all feel. So now, as soon as I release the ball, or release the button, the ball gets released. So I can go late. And that's late. Like, okay. so if you look at that, I held on too long. Now, what I'm currently looking at, ladies and gentlemen, is a replay of LeBron's form. He can literally hold it as long as he wants, or let it go as early as he wants, and his form won't look the same. It'll actually release the ball from where he's at. So he looks slightly early. So what's cool about that is you get to uh, you get to understand why you missed that shot. Like last year we had the feedback, too early, too late, and you really, it was hard to understand because you didn't have the animation feedback. Right, and I got a of lot of great releases last yeah, year. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. And then the other thing we've done from a shot feedback si uh, system, uh, you see the meter here. So you see the meter, it shows you like the timing and your percent success rate. And then if you, it'll show you if you miss a shot, why you miss a shot. So it's like, oh, it's contested, slightly early. Oh, it gets yeah. you a full breakdown. Yeah. Yeah, okay. still okay. sim. Like if I hit a perfect shot, it's still gonna miss sometimes because that's how it is in real life. Right. Right. It's not like if you hit the apex of the meter, it's gonna go in. It's not like that. All right. So it's not gonna go in every single time, yeah. ladies and gentlemen. Just sim. Don't expect it to yeah. go in like an arcade game. Yeah. But that's gonna give you the best chance as a player to get a bucket. Okay. So now, so next thing I want to do is I'm gonna back out. Uh, so we talked about dribbling. We talked about shooting. Now we're going to talk about um, a bunch of other stuff. So I'm going to go into scrimmage. All right, we're going into a 5v5 scrimmage game. This is the demo at E3, guys. Oh, I want to be in Golden State. So now what we're going to look at is, you know, one of my favorite features this year which is live motion. Uh, He's about to do something with Steph Curry. I'm, I'm, I'm a little hyped right now. Uh-oh, chef, the chef guys. So what I want to check, check out here is if you just look at Harrison Barnes and how he's moving around the court, he's right. moving with a purpose. And, and there's a big physicality piece. So we have a brand new locomotion system called live motion. So let's just take a look at Harrison Barnes for the next... So what we're looking at here is Harrison Barnes cutting to the hoop, cutting through, oh, and, it looks, nice and, it looks, and it looks seamless. You know, he pops up to the top. Now he's going to cut down through. So while nothing's happening with yeah. the ball handler, yeah. other guys are trying to get open and trying to make things happen. Right, and, now, and then what you're seeing here is the physicality piece. So you're going to see tons of 
short swims, little jostles, you can bump cutters. Um, and this will be really cool when you're playing in other modes, not necessarily as a ball carrier. And now, he, now Harrison Barnes cut from baseline and popped out. LeBron was caught inside of a pick. And then Tristan Thompson was caught off the switch. Yeah. And so as a defender, you can also use the LT button to deny the ball, bump cutters. There's a whole bunch of new mechanics that you can use. And offensively, you can use your right stick to push off. Like I could hit you, hit the right stick, pop out, uh, okay, swim so like around him. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Yeah. So it's something, really something like what Steph Curry does mainly yeah. for that left corner. Right. And then if you see up here, um, I thought I saw it, yeah, so like, so this isn't the final stuff, like, because you can be able to deny the player anytime he's moving the ball, but you can deny the ball, you can deny the ball when he's standing, when he's moving, force him to catch a little further from the hoop. Okay. Um, so that's what I'm really excited about, is our, because, you know, we've had, we've been plagued with, you know, our animation just isn't up to par with the competitor, right, right. and now I really feel like it's no time. game looks that good when players move around the court. Okay. You heard it here first. Yeah. Um, so Shots that's fired. <laughs> I'm not talking about like another basketball thing. I'm talking about oh any yeah, any game, any game, yeah, any game because the, the physical animations are looking pretty good. Right now we have J.R. Smith denying Clay Thompson is what I'm looking at, and Clay Thompson is fighting to get open, and Jr. is like, no, not yet, man, not yet. So Clay Thompson in act had to pop off and cut around because he realized J.R. Smith is denying ball, so he can't just stand there and get denied all night. So he had to move around and try to get open. Cool, so that's live motion. Um, what you're seeing here, <laughs> um, and I should talk about it because last year we didn't have a ton of movement away from the ball. As you can see, there's a lot more going on when you just when when the ball carrier is just dribbling. So which is no, so which shows off the feature and it's authentic. But what you're not seeing here is all of the authentic sets, and that's going to be something that we're going to showcase later. And play calling authentic sets, and you know how that works, which is something I'm really excited about. I, w I would love to come out. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um, the next thing I wanted to showcase is um, what I call or it's called uh, dribble handoff or DHO, right? So, whoops, wrong button there. So I can just call a guy over. Oh my, ladies and gentlemen, look, look. We know, we know you guys play 2K, we know this. But what I just seen in live is an actual ball handoff off of just a small little, oh my, look. How many, how many people have always been mad that a player that gets handed the ball right next to another does not look exactly right like it does in real life? Well, guess what? In NBA Live, it looks perfect. This is an actual handoff. Steph Curry receives the ball and just goes straight to the rim. Not one of those animations where you have to get thrown the ball and have to run to a spot for it. You run to the ball and the ball is met with, oh my goodness. Look, I, I'm, oh my goodness. Let's, let's What's cool more. about that is um, I just hit the, hold the B button. I point to whoever I want to do DHO with mm -hmm. and then it's, they'll just come over. So I'll now, show with that actual animation, say a player wants to try to get that still. Is that 100% a, a of foul? against the defender every time because he's kind of being blocked off a little yeah, bit. Yeah. So like if he lunges at the ball, is there that- will, There will be a foul, but not 100%. Not 100%, okay. All right. So I'll try it up here. Um, that, was, that looks good. So let's say I want I want to go DHO with uh, JR here, boom. Pull up. Through. And what's cool about that, it really allows us to do a lot because it, uh, with our sets, because there's so many sets that are now run, yeah. which is triple handoff action everywhere instead yeah. of uh, like just right. ball screens. Conventional screens and yeah. high yeah. screen and rolls, they different. don't do it no more. Yeah. Yeah. The other thing, um, I don't know if you checked out Madden at all, yeah, with their, like their end man stuff. Like the, so we're using the same tech, so we can also, if there's a defender in there, you'll uh, it's not in yet, but you're gonna see dribble handoffs with screens as a part of it. So you pull the third guy in, which will be dope. Which will be cool. Oh, that'll work good with the big man like Mozgov. Yeah, man. Dribble handoff screen and then cut to the rim yeah. for the alley oop. Oh my God. Yeah. Okay. So that's that's one of that's a cool feature from uh, just like a passing standpoint. Um, the other thing I want to talk about uh, from straight up passing is uh, we have touch passing. So all you have to do is queue up a pass in midair. So here's a, here's one example of a touch pass. 
So all in one motion, like oh. catch. And pass. He didn't get. He didn't have to gather. No, no, he no. didn't have to dribble. You don't have to wait for it that animation to be over. You can as pass right As soon as you it. catch it, he starts his pass. And it looks like a real pass. It's not one of those you catch the ball and it's a flashy pass automatically. No. This is this looks real. And I was late on it because I was like I saw Harrison. I was late on it, but if I'd have used that in the proper context, it would have been the easy cut bucket, to the basket or, or a three, a dunk on Mozgov or yeah, something. Yeah, or a three, <laughs> right? Like I could have hit him here. Right, hit him right in the corner. Yeah. Well, for his money shot, that's his yeah. money shot. Yeah. Everybody knows that's Barnes' money shot. He loves the right corner. So that's touch passing, uh, dribble handoff, and now I want to show you what we've done with pick and roll mechanics. So pick and roll I thought was pretty cool last year, like it was fun, easy to use, but we've taken it to the next level and I'll show you how. So I just touch pass. So now, oh wait, I need a defender. First thing I want to show you is what we've done from what, how we use live motion. Now watch this play, watch Draymond's intention as he comes to the ball. He's moving and stopping to set a screen all in one motion. So I can go at any time here, so it's a lot more fluid. I don't have to wait for the screen to be set. If I if I go around the screen right now, he's gonna set it. This might be a legal screen, might, might be not be. Yeah. Um, but just it's from all an about animation. what the ref thinks. Yes, exactly. <laughs> so now, so if I just let go, he'll slip. Well, just like last year, but if I hold it, I screen. Oh shit, he's got to use it. Rescreen. Oh, yeah. So you can double screen, turn. Yeah. Screen, rescreen. Oh my hold. god, that's Steph Curry all the yeah. way. Cheese my three point shot. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah, so it's, it's really cool. And then I can pop, but yeah. Oh, I like that auto lunge. You like that? <laughs> so is there, is there he said, not, not in my screen? passing lanes. Uh, so no, like two guys. Yeah, like set a double. Screen. Those will be in some of our sets. Okay. But right now it's just it's just an advancement to the mechanic where I can screen if I hold it, use it. If there's nothing there, I can come back and he'll rescreen right away. Okay. Like and I'll have all the footwork with it as well. So. Run out of the way. So. Screen. How about our controllers? You tell me which one. Yeah. Yeah, you're screen. LeBron. Yeah, just guard the ball. So, yeah. So, well, you got to press A to change, yeah. change character. Yeah. So screen. The rescreen get you again. Oh, nice. and, and then a like roll that. for a bucket. So okay, that's 70%. Yeah. 78% and then guard it. Okay. Yeah, do you understand okay, so how that, that works? Ah, uh, okay. So percentages on like layups and all of that? Uh, they will be turned off for layups, but it'll just be for uh, shooting. shooting. But you're seeing a special. I think it's going to be turned off depending yeah, on. So like this this uh, level of difficulty actually allows it because it's yeah. in demo mode, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So um, the other thing, so that's pick and roll, rescreen, dribble handoffs, touch passing, live motion, shooting. I think that's it for. I think that's it for, for defense. We're not talking. We're talking about deny ball, uh, which is a mechanic where you just hold the LT button. Like if you just if you want to deny him. It's right now. It doesn't work while the player's like moving. But that's in like that. That's coming. So, just, so you when can you just, press A, when you, press, you can go to another you player. Can switch right? off ball, hold LT, and you can deny him the ball. So you can deny Tristan the ball. If you want it, yeah. So like, 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 Bar uh, I mean, yeah. I, Draymond. Draymond is denying yeah. LeBron, but LeBron is cutting through because he's more powerful. Yes, 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 yes. So that's what we're doing this year so far. Uh, we got a lot more to show in the next couple months, but uh, I'm really happy with the progress. I think it's going to be the best live ever, just from a pure gameplay standpoint. Um, and visuals, it's looking a lot better too. A lot better. Um, you know, a lot a lot of people gave a lot of flack last year yeah. because of the player models, but this year it looks like you guys. Because I remember watching the Twitter account, yeah, and you guys were on the road since last year, capturing bodies, capturing faces, yeah, and making sure that you guys got it as good as possible. And I can tell you now that that uh, pregame, LeBron put between the leg off the backboard. Oh my god! That's and those good. are just some of the right. Now, one, I do have one question. I don't know if you can answer it. Celebrations. We've seen uh, Hoop God. Yeah. We've seen him do the Steph Curry celebration and shot. Yeah. Will you be able to choose your own celebration? Well, how can I say that without saying, like, for uh, in in this mo in in uh, 
just tip off and regular stuff, no. But there might be a possibility in some of the other stuff we're going to talk about later. Rising star. <laughs> okay. Hey, I want to. I want to thank. Thank you, man. No, no problem, man. Thanks oh, for coming and checking it thanks, out. Thanks, man. Yeah, come uh, by. I did. I did want to get a picture with you. Uh, probably like with a pause screen, maybe. Yeah. Why don't we just do it right up here? 